Welcome back everyone. In this video we're going to take a look at Blender edit mode creating and deleting things. And by things we are talking about vertices, edges and faces. So this pops up in your models where you don't want your model to have all of its faces. You want to take some faces out. It can be really useful. Let's take a look at the cube here. I'm going to take my cube. I'm going to hit tab to go into edit mode. I'm going to select face. I'm going to right click and grab the top face and I'm going to delete it by hitting X. X couldn't be easier. I hit X. It asks me what do I want to delete? Well, I want to delete the face. So if you know what a face is, hit face. There it goes. And you notice now you have an empty box. Perfect. Okay, face deleted. If you wanted to right click, select that face so down there, X, delete face. Perfect. Now you've got this whatever it is, right? Sort of cardboard box with no top and bottom. Let's say you change your mind. You want to create a face. Well, to create a face, you have to have a couple of edges selected. So let's go to edge selection mode. Let's go right click, shift, click, shift, click, shift, click. Or by the way, if you just had one of these selected, you can use the Alt key and just go right click and it loops around and grabs all of them for you really quickly. And now if we want to create a face, it's super easy. Just hit F and it creates a face. Funny enough, F will also create an edge. If you're missing an edge, F is just for like fill. So it filled with a face there. Okay, now I still have the bottom missing, but let's say you right click the edge grab all the edges, right click, right click, right click, hit F, and you got your back box back to normal again. Now that's sort of a lame example. Let's move the cube to the side. So I'll hit tab to get out of edit mode. I'll move it off to the side. Let's get the sphere in there. And with the sphere in there, well, I'm going to do a very common one that students always ask. They want half of the sphere or only part of it, right? They want half of a ball. So here we go. Going to use a bunch of tricks here to do this one. The first trick is this. I'm going to want to select everything on the lower half of the sphere and delete it. So let's start by doing that. The easiest way to get everything selected on the bottom half of the sphere is to actually get a nice head-on view. Now you could try doing this, right? Get nice head-on, or you can go view front. Let's see the front of the sphere, numpad 1. You'll notice the numpad actually, 1, 3, 7, 9. Now we're not talking about the numpad, I'm not talking about the numpad like the numbers 1 to 9 above your letters. We're talking about the number pad. If your keyboard has a number pad, does this. So let's get the front view by hitting 1. And let's go into edit mode, hit the tab key. Everything is selected by default right now. You can hit the letter A to toggle that, or just go select, deselect all. And now I need to select all these faces below the line. So all that. The easiest way is either with the circle select or the border select. I'll use the border select, and I'm going to grab everything there. And whoops. It only grabbed what I could see. Ah, so remember from a previous video, let's just go backwards, that this magic button here, see through the object for selecting. Perfect. Now let's try the border select. And it's going to grab everything below, go a little higher up. Let's try that again, border select. You know what? Let's leave it at that. Let's see what happens when we delete this. And now I hit X. And I want to delete faces. And notice what we got. So I should have selected one row higher, but you know, we get the same idea here. We have our nice sphere with the bottom cut off. All those faces are gone. If you hit the tab key, you can sort of see what you have. You have a bowl. Now, of course, let me leave the bowl like this. If you do want the bottom to be back on, all we have to do is create a face. Now this face is going to be a big face. Let's go back, tab key. And this time let's grab the edges, right click, 
you could go shift right click right click right click hold in the tab key down make sure you don't grab any that you shouldn't have and once you go all the way around you can just hit the letter F to create a face or the faster way you remember from before we can use the alt key just go alt right click whoops alt right click and that does the whole loop okay continues around now that you have all those edges just hit F and what it did was it just made that face for you it looks a little funny now but remember we still have this button on down here hit the tab key to get out of edit mode and you have yourself a nice half sphere or almost half sphere okay I was close so that's sort of good for chopping objects right so the two commands X to delete F to create. Thanks for watching.